Hello everyone, my name is Majid and today I'm gonna tell you 50 things to know before traveling to Iran. Alright, the first four are about visa. Alright, number one. You can ask for a visa on arrival at Iran International Airport and it's valid for 30 days. Nowadays, more than 180 countries are eligible to get a visa on arrival, but for a few countries, still it's not possible to get a arrival visa. Number 2 Some country citizens can't get a visa on arrival, so they need to get a visa at the council. Citizens of United States, Canada, United Kingdom, Bangladesh, Jordan, Iraq, Afghanistan, and Pakistan need to get consular visas. First, they need to get an authorization number, then apply for the visa. U.S. citizens could get a visa through Washington D.C. interest section of Iran, the Pakistan embassy. Number three: Israeli citizens cannot enter Iran. Also, other country citizens who have been in Israel and have Israel stamp in their passport cannot enter Iran. But on the internet, you will find some tips to solve that problem and travel to Iran as many other people do. Number 4. Brits and Canadians may now travel to Iran without a guide. Recently, improving political relations between Iran and the West have loosened some tight rules regarding travel, although you won't find any official statements about this. Previously, UK and Canadian citizens were required to book a tour with a guide for duration of their visit. Requirements for US passport holders remain the same into 2018. So this has been the first 4 out of 50 things to know before traveling to Iran. Be sure to check back for video number 2 where I will discuss another important topic for Iran tourism money. Thanks for watching and if you have anything to add let me know in the comments and don't forget to like, share and subscribe.